to you. Today, we are going to continue lesson 5, the clothes we wear. Yesterday, we already started the lesson and first we can uh, do a quick revision and then I will explain a small topic uniform. Okay, are you ready? Good. So, why do we wear clothes? Why do we wear clothes? Clothes protect us from heat, cold, rain, dust, dirt and insects. We wear different types of clothes in different seasons. So, clothes protect us from heat, cold, rain, dust, dirt and insects. We wear different types of clothes in different seasons seasons what are the different types of seasons summer winter and rainy season see in summer weather is very hot and in winter it is very cold and during rainy season we get heavy rain so according to these seasons we wear different types of dresses next we can see what are the different types of dresses we wear according to the seasons first one summer in summer it is very hot okay day is very hot in summer so we wear cotton clothes to keep our body cool in summer Weather is very hot. The days are very bright and uh, very hot. So we wear cotton clothes to keep our body cool. So in summer we wear cotton clothes. In summer we wear cotton clothes. So you can see different types of cotton clothes. You can see cotton frock, shorts, okay, t-shirts, okay. All these are examples of cotton dresses. So in summer, weather is very hot. So we wear cotton clothes to keep our body cool. Okay, and from where we get cotton? Yes. We, go, we get cotton from cotton plants. We get cotton from cotton plants. You can see the uh, picture of cotton plant, right? You can see cotton fl plant flowers, uh, seeds, and when it um, and when we open the seed, we can see white color balls of cotton. Okay, look very beautiful, right? So we get cotton from cotton plants we get cotton from cotton plants in summer we wear cotton clothes in summer we wear cotton clothes and we get cotton from cotton plants we get cotton from cotton plants next is winter season look at the picture oh, oh, these uh, children wear sweaters caps socks etc right so in winter people wear woolen clothes in winter people wear woolen clothes to keep uh, our body warm okay to keep our body warm in winter it is very cold okay it is very cold in winter it is very cold in winter so we wear woolen clothes in winter woolen clothes keep us warm woolen clothes keep us warm it is very cold in winter okay in winter season it is very cold so people wear woolen clothes clothes keep us warm woolen clothes keep us warm okay and uh, mufflers sweaters then uh, 
caps all these are examples of uh, woolen clothes muffler is an example sweater is an example okay so during winter season it is very cold okay um, so we wear woolen clothes to keep our body warm in winter season we wear woolen clothes to keep our body warm okay why do we wear woolen clothes in winter in winter we wear woolen clothes to keep our body warm during summer season we wear cotton clothes to keep our body cool and in winter we wear woolen clothes to keep our body warm okay we get wool from goat sheep and camel okay we woolen clothes are made up of wool woolen clothes are made up of wool and we get wool from goat sheep and camel you can see sheep goat and camel in the picture okay and we just cut the uh, hair of these animals can you see the picture one person is cutting the hair of the uh, goat okay so uh, we cut the hair of camel goat and sheep uh, thus we get wool okay using wool we make woolen clothes can you see a bundle of uh, wool over here you can see right uh, very spongy very smooth very soft white color wool you can see over here okay so wool we get wool from animals we get wool from animals we cut the hair of animals like camel goat and sheep and thus we get wool okay using wool we make woolen clothes woolen clothes are made up of wool woolen clothes are made up of wool understand and next is rainy season during rainy season we wear so many things like raincoat okay gumboots umbrella caps etc etc okay to keep our keep our body dry understand it rains heavily during rainy season okay uh, last week we got heavy rain right because this is a rainy season okay it rains heavily during rainy season we should wear rain coats gum boots and umbrellas during rainy season these things protect us from rain okay these things keep our body dry okay it rains heavily during rainy season and so we should wear raincoats gum boots and umbrellas during rainy season to protect us from to protect us from rain okay all these things like raincoats gum boots and umbrellas are made up of waterproof materials what do you mean by waterproof materials waterproof materials are materials that never soft in water nananju kudarilla nammal ipo paper avanda paper aanu cover cheyyanacha endu cheyyum vellam nananja adu angane kudarnu povu le adhe pole nammada cotton clothes o angane endengilum aanu endana adokke vellam absorb cheyana materials aanu pakshe chela materials unda like plastic like plastic and other um, other uh, things okay that do not uh, gets soft in rain that do not soft vellathil adu kudarilla that do not soft appo what do you mean by waterproof materials materials that do not get soft in rain that do not get soft in water vellathil kudirata sadhanangal appo example plastic plastic inde endu sadhana resin nokka panakkala materials inde appo plastic is an example പ്ലാസ്റ്റിക് വെള്ളം അബ്സോർബ് ചെയ്യോ പ്ലാസ്റ്റിക് കവറിൻ്റെ ഉള്ളിലേക്ക് വെള്ളം കയറോ ഇല്ല പേപ്പർ പാക്കറ്റ് ആണെങ്കിലോ ഈസി ആയിട്ട് വെള്ളം അബ്സോർബ് ചെയ്യും അല്ലേ അപ്പോൾ വെള്ളം അബ്സോർബ് ചെയ്യാത്ത വെള്ളത്തിൽ നനയാത്ത 
മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് ഞാൻ എന്ത് പറയുന്നത് വാട്ടർ പ്രൂഫ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് ഓർമ്മയിൽ ഉണ്ടാവുക വാട്ട് ഈസ് വാട്ടർ പ്രൂഫ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് ദാറ്റ് ഡു നോട്ട് ഗെറ്റ് സോക്ക്ഡ് ഇൻ വാട്ടർ ദാറ്റ് ഡു നോട്ട് ഗെറ്റ് സോക്ക്ഡ് ഇൻ വാട്ടർ അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ചെയ്ത് വി യൂസ് റെയിൻ ഗോഡ് ഗംബൂഡ് ആൻഡ് അംബ്രല്ലാസ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് റെയിനി സീസൺ ഓൾ ദീസ് തിങ്സ് ആർ മെയ്ഡ് അപ്പ് ഓഫ് വാട്ടർ പ്രൂഫ് മെറ്റീരിയൽസ് അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഗുഡ് ആൻഡ് നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഈസ് സിൽക്ക് ക്ലോത്ത്സ് we get silk from silk worm we get silk from silk worms silk thread is shiny we get silk from silk worms and silk is a sh- uh, very shiny thread okay silk is a shiny thread okay. can you see silk worm in the picture okay and you can also see some balls white color balls these are called cocoons these are called cocoons we have to put these cocoons inside boil water and uh, we have to kill the uh, worms to get uh, silk okay and it is very expensive and it is very bright and shiny thread silk is a shiny thread understand and next is uniform what do you mean by uniform special cloth where for work is called uniform the mainly uniform uh, is used to or used to identify people of same group okay so doctors wear uh, uniform uh, similarly postmen wear uniform soldiers wear uniform nurses wear uniform and school children wear uniform okay the, uh, so uh, it is very easy to identify a group of people okay okay while wearing dress we have to wear clean and tidy clothes and also we should wear clothes according to the season and occasion okay according to the occasion and also according to the season we have to uh, change our clothes understand this much for today next monday we will do the activities thank you so much bye